country lay a cornfield, and in the middle of the field stood one lonely scarecrow. The scarecrow was made of hay, and he wore old clothes with a fluffy hat on his head. He had one job to do, scare the animals away from the field so they did not eat the corn. But there was one itsy bitsy problem. The scarecrow was afraid of the animals. In fact, he was afraid of everything. He was a scary crow. When crow flew by in the day, scary crow would say, Oh no! Here comes the crow! Please don't crack at my hair! Then instead of trying to scare him, he would shake his head, wave his arms and shout, Crow, crow, go away! Come again another day! And the crow flew away. When bat swooped by in the night, scared the crow would squeal, w What's that? It must be... Bats! Please don't screech at me. Then instead of scaring him, he would close his eyes, cover his ears and yell, Bat, bat, don't attack. Please leave and don't come back. And the bat swooped away. Scary Crow really was scared of everything. But what he didn't know was that everything was scared of him. His waving and shaking frightened the crow during the day. His yelling and screaming worried the bat through the night. Everybody was scared of each other. Then one day, a little field mouse moved to the farm. All the animals greeted him. The mouse noticed his scared crow standing by himself in the field. What's that? He asked his new friends. Whatever you do, stay away from that scarecrow. He is scary. He loves to yell and will catch you if you go near him. Said the animals. The little mouse looked back at scary crow again. He didn't look scary at all. Just very lonely. If the animals hadn't greeted me when I moved to the farm, I might have been all alone. Maybe all he needs is a friend. So the little mouse scurried into the field. When scary crow heard the little mouse, he closed his eyes and shrieked, oh, A monster! But even though scary crow startled him, the little field mouse did not run away. He waited patiently for scary crow to calm down and then said, Hello! friends with me? asked Scary Crow. He had never made a friend before. He was always too scared. Tiny smiled and said, Yes, I do. And might I add, you were certainly not as scary as the crow and bats told me. They are scared of me? How could that be? asked Scary Crow. They are scared because you always yell and wave your arms at them. They think you want to catch them, said Tiny. Scared the crow knew what it felt like to be scared, and the last thing he wanted was to frighten the other animals. What can I do to show them that I'm not scary? He asked Tiny. Let's invite the animals to the field so they can meet you. Then, you can show them what a nice scarecrow you are, Tiny Squeak. Tiny gathered all the animals and brought them out to the cornfield. The animals were nervous. What would the scarecrow do? Hello, scarecrow, Tiny said. And instead of shouting and waving, Scary Crow smiled and said, Hello friends, would you like some corn on the cob? Soon, 
Everybody was laughing and having a great time. And Scary Crow wasn't scared of anything anymore. Well, almost anything. The end.